Yeah, I'm in trouble. Well, fortunately, I was able to grind this special two flats on here. That was enough to let me finally get this stuff down into the block to pull this bushing out. So, got a nice bushing with the correct fit inside and outside, uh, but it doesn't fit anything here, so that was a waste. Because uh, this is the bushing that belongs in here. It shouldn't go on with the paper on it. So, we gotta go make another bushing. This time with the correct ID. Same OD as this one. I gotta fix the ID here. So, well, I guess I'll head up to the Monarch and turn out another bushing. And we'll come back and try this again. Well, I should have two bushings made the correct size this time. So, maybe with a little luck, this will be the last time I put this together. Got my special installation tool turned down. So, goes in there just like that. Bearing retaining compound on the outside this time. It's hard to get up in that bore, so. Cheat. Some of it's going to get wiped off putting it up through there, but should still do the job. It's like molasses coming out of here. It's cold in here.
definitely right on on my fit. It's tight. This one here goes in with the uh, notch to the top. Yeah, so I can't pull it in from the inside. It's lined up pretty good. There it comes. Now I'm taking my dial bore gauge and checking this. So I'm, my roundness is good. Less than a tenth. And I'm right at a thousandth tighter than this worn bushing. Don't know what spec is, so can't go beyond that, but yeah. Put a little oil on here. It's 
look this dude up in here. You know, I like that. No rock. Good and tight. Turns nice. Hmm. No slot. Front or back. Well, I hope you enjoyed getting to see this challenging little project working in this small diameter hole way back in here that's blind. So, they made all the way through, been life a lot easier, but that's not how they did it. So, but nevertheless, I have prevailed and it looks good. It's ready to go back to the customer. So, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. I'll catch y'all later.